Oh wow, this is a pretty fun to play. Easily juggling him. I can't wait to bomb some of the dongos. Do 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 do. Where would that gold skull toy be? Oh, it's right there. Got the gold skull toy. I think I found the heart container or the heart piece. Just in a chest under a rock here in the northern field. Heart container, nice! Entire freaking extra heart. Okay, that's pretty cool, I have to say. And just like that, heart piece right here yep sure enough the heart piece is there and now I've done everything there is to do I've got the gold skull toy and the two heart items oh so I found it, it took me absolutely forever, but it's in a rock right next to the exit. I got the heart container with Impa, which means I have to replay this as Sheik. Yay! Seriously, it's right there off to the side. As you can tell, I literally went step by step taking control of everything. And I was so confused because it wasn't anywhere I expected it to be. I already know where the Impa one is going to be. I it cannot not be there. So I'll be going through in just a bit to uh, do that. That feeling when uh, oh, I think I got it, guys. Don't know why it wasn't up on the cliff that I was looking at, but. Da 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 da! Got the heart piece with Link. So I think I can just, you know, save and quit the level. Man. Wait. Oh, come on! It's right here! Well guys, um, this took absolutely forever for me to find. This is actually my second time going through the level as Sheik, which means I have to beat this again, and this is the next day. Like, I did this, like, late last, no, two days ago? It was, like, yeah, it was technically two days ago. It was just late the night before last. And I'm, yeah, some, these are really well hidden. Screw it. I'm showing off the chicken now. If you fight the cuckoo over here, he will get quite distraught after a moment. I said quite distraught after a moment. Eventually. Yep. Preparing a counter attack. Okay. That's. Okay. Well, I don't see any counter attack. Seems to be dead. He dropped an egg. Huh. Sweet. We got a free egg. Wait. Is it seriously not doing it? Is it because of the cutscene thing that's happening? Oh, there we go. And I'm going to say that this is probably infinite. And as you can tell, not fun to actually fight since they deal a lot of damage. As they should, because these are cuckoos. Cuckoos are known to be vicious. And I'm out. Let's hope they don't follow me so I don't have to die here. Oh, they're all over the board, aren't they? I wonder if there's actually anything relating to... 
Oh, Kaku received more reinforcements. A golden Kaku? Oh, you are mine! Sorry, I just got a little bit pissed off right there. As you can see, oh my gosh, this is fun. Don't want to get hit by that. Well, those are there, but I wanted to use this against them for the sake of hitting them all away. And get him in this combo. If I, I wonder what happens if I kill the Golden Cuckoo. Am I even blown away by it? I mean, he's already halfway dead, but already a really subjective term considering. I've been fighting this guy for a little bit. I like how that, that wind attack is actually based on whatever element I just was using. Hit you. Gotcha. Come on, you're almost dead. Oh, come on, there has to be something good for beating this thing. Defeating the gold cuckoo. Wait, that's it? It just makes note of the fact that I beat it? That sucks. Now I have to run from the cuckoos for the rest of this. Which hopefully I can finish this guy up here pretty soon. Because honestly I can't survive against Cuckoos for that long. And... Let's see how that works. Sure enough, it's right there in the northern square. So guys, this is where the heart piece is, not the heart container. You can only get it as Impa, and it is right there. Got the piece of heart. So guys, I'll see you on the next level. Oh, found another rock. And I found it, guys. Off on the west side over here, you will find a rock. And once you blow it up, you will get the heart container. Now this will be an easy thing coming up here. So I'll meet you guys back in a bit once I've uh, finished this and go back in as... I don't remember who the second person was. I'm going to say Link, but I don't remember. Wow, more hard, more rare drops, more high rank weapons. And finish. So guys, up here at the summit of the Valley of the Seers is the heart container. I totally forgot to pick it up the last time I was here. I feel like an idiot. I'm a dum-dum. I'm a stupid. So I had to do this entire level again. I'm the least happy person. But it's a thing, and I'm done. And I just need to kill Manhandla, which sadly takes about seven minutes from what I can tell, since this is my third time having to do it today. Because, you know, I had to do it once to get uh, Lana's thing, then once to try to get Sheik's and forgetting to grab the item, had to do it again. 
All right, if you come right up here on this ledge, you can get the gold skull tool. A really simple thing to do. Okay, found it. So guys, southeast, uh, well, eh. Yeah, okay, okay. I want to be sure that I was actually getting it and not something else. I was worried there for a moment. But yeah, just uh, southeast of this boulder keep up here, the east boulder keep, is where the heart container is with Sheik. Now, I'm going to go beat Darunia since I've done everything else in this match already. Oh, I found it, guys. In this northeast Goron keep up here, there is a red chest, and I'm hoping this is it so I don't look foolish, but I think this is it, guys. You got the heart piece! Alright, got the piece of heart. I think I found it, guys. The last place uh, I think I can check. Yep, sure enough, it's right here. Got the heart, can heart container for Darunia. Now, guys, I'll see you in the next mission. And I found it, guys. One heart caner. Yeah, heart caner? Heart container coming right up. Alright, so apparently I needed to have the hook shot to get up here. Okay, throw it. I'm pressing. Uh, these mechanics, how do they work? Also, I'm playing through these levels on easy now. I give up playing hard. It, it just takes like an hour. And I think I found it. Found the gold skull claw. Right up here. Oh. Is that it? And guys, here is the heart container. I'm going to say container. Peace, peace. Container, dang it. Got the heart container. So guys, that's the end of this mission. I'm going to beat up Zant and, uh, oh, this should be a lot of fun. I'm actually really liking playing against Midnight. She's really fun to play. See, I can just get a giant ball of energy and smash everyone. It's really freaking cool. She's one of my favorite characters to play right now. <clears throat> oh. Well, I found one of them, guys. I'm not sure which, since this is the first one I found. I'm gonna guess... Heart piece? Piece of heart. I got a piece of heart. Sweet! Also, since this is taking so long, I got hungry, so I'm now nomming on, uh... Some, uh... What's this stuff called? Sausage sticks? Yeah, those. I found a rock, I found a rock, I found a rock, I'm blowing up the rock, please let it be it. And it's it. Alright, perfect. This rock is on the south side of the map. Honestly, I was just running back to try to clear out some of the keeps before I beat Volga. And it's the heart container, fantastic. Alright, now I'm heading back up to take care of Volga. Found one of them, guys. This is like half an hour into this. I'm right at the end, about to fight Girheem. And here we go. A heart container. So I think the other one in this level, you have to come back with Link. So I'll meet you guys back here with Link. Alright, guys. Over here in this western keep, there is this little chest here, and I'm pretty sure it is the heart can heart piece not container. Heart piece, yeah. So now we're finally done. We've gotten every single heart piece and heart container in this game so far. And we've got all the sculptors. So I guess all that's left is to meet you guys next time. So guys, 
next time on Let's Play Hyrule Warriors, we'll be moving on to the story. We'll be really doing the first episode I've recorded in a long time where we're having huge story events. Because I think that's where everyone starts meeting back together. We're closing the Gates of Souls, and I think at that point is the point where, well, evil things start happening, I'm gonna be guessing. Because that means we're gonna be moving on the offensive, and let's just say I know. I don't know anything yet. I just have a really odd feeling. Or actually, maybe I'm supposed to be using this. <laughs>